The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, 3rd Canto, 26th Chapter, Text Number 47, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on the 22nd of January, 1975, in Bombay, India. Bayudna Visheshatha Jasta Tatsparanam Vidu So, Itha is Kai. We cannot see, we cannot touch, we cannot smell, but we can hear the sound. As soon as there is sound, that we know that there is ether or span. Sound, by reason, as we have got experience of this material sound, and therefore the material sky, similarly, there is spiritual sound and there is spiritual sound. Without sky, there is no sound. So, there is spiritual sound. We get information from Shastra, but of boom. Boom is called sky. And there is another sky, which is material sky, but we have experience. There is spiritual sky. And about that spiritual realization, as this creation begins from the sky, itha, then earth, then fire, then water, then land, titi of the Marud bomb. Similarly, the spiritual world also begins from the spiritual sky after this sky ends. Then the spiritual sky begins. That is stated in the Bhagavad Gita, Paratasmatu Bhava Anya. There is another Bhava means nature. That is Shanatan nature. Itana nature. This nature, this sky, is temporary. It has got a duration of life maybe millions and trillions of years, but it is not permanent. It is emanating from the Supreme Lord breathing period, just say the Nishasita Kalava Thavalamba, Jivanti Loma Bilaja Jagadandana Tha. So, after this sky, there is another sky, and the sound produced from that sky is Omkar and Hare Krishna Mundi. This is the sound vibration from the spiritual sky. Therefore it is effective immediately. Just like you contact thousands of minds away, somebody is speaking and you can contact by the sound vibration you catch up with your machine, radio machine. Similarly, the sound vibration from the spiritual sky, you can answer this. That is Hare Krishna. Therefore, Narthamda Thakur has described this Hare Krishna mantra, not of this material sky. Golopira Prema Dhana Hari Nama Sankirtan. Hari Nama Sankirtan. This is not a material sound. And in the Vedanta, it is stated, Saddhad Anavritti, by chanting the spiritual sound, the impersonal is the chant Omka, Pranava. Sarva Bhidi Shu. All Vedic mantras, mantras have preceded by the spiritual Omkar. That Omkar, Krishna says, Aksharana. Omkar is me. A Vedi Shu. Pranava Sarva Bhidi Shu. Aum Aum. These are described in Bhagavad Gita. So, either you vibrate Omkar or Hare Krishna Mantra, they belong to the 
spiritual world. This sound does not belong to this material. Material sound, if you chant once, twice, thrice, in pain, disgust. But spiritual sound, if you chant twenty-four hours, you never feel disgusted, but you feel more and more spiritual bliss. That is the difference. You actually you see these boys and girls and others. They are chanting Hare Krishna practically from early in the morning, five o'clock till ten o'clock daily, but nobody is feeling any disgust. They like the chant. That is the difference between material sound and spiritual sound. So we can enter into the spiritual war, spiritual sky. The spiritual sky is there, Sanatan, that is eternal, Sanatan. Everything eternal there. In the material world, they are everything temporary, Hasat. And everything in the spiritual world that is called Sat, Om Tat Sat. Very spiritual world. So hmm. the basic intention is Asutoma Sadgama. Try to transcend from this Asat material world to go to the spiritual world. Sat Om Tatsa. That is actually our business. In the human form of life. This is the only business. How to transfer me to the spiritual world? Sanatan. Because I am Sanatan. Jiva Bhuta Sanatan. Jiva is Sanatan. Itana. Na Hannate Hannamani Sarire. The Jeev is never destroyed after the destruction or annihilation of this body. Is it on? Nikta Sasukayam Nahanati Annamane Sadi. So, this is our reason that I am eternal as Krishna, God is Satchitananda Vidra, and I am part and parcel of Satchitananda Vidra. So, as Krishna is eternal, so I am also eternal. The Vedic Mantra says that Nitya Nityanam. Krishna is Nitya Itaral, and we have fuller number Nityanam. Chetana Chetana Nam. Tachit. So, as Krishna is Sachidananda Vigraha, so we are also Sachidananda Vigraha. The difference is Krishna is the maintainer. Vishnu is the maintainer, and we are maintained. Uh, we are not maintainer. Uh, there are millions and trillions of living entities, not only in this universe, there are millions and trillions of universes, and there are millions and trillions of planets. Just saprava prabhavato jagadana koti, Kotishu Asesha Bhasudhadi Din Vibhuti Dindam. Kotishu, there are innumerable universes, and as you see, experience within this universe, within this ball like sky. Even in the night, at least we can see so many twinkling stars. Similarly, there are innumerable universes, and there are innumerable. In each and every universe, there is innumerable, this planet. This is called material world. You cannot estimate how many universes are there or how many planets are there. But this is only one fourth manifestation of God's creation. All these universes taken together, He comes in a This is only one fourth manifestation. Therefore, the Vaikuntha spiritual world is called Tripad Vibhusa. 
three four. This is one four. So just imagine we cannot have any estimation, even the one four manifestation of the one fourth energy of God. And what to speak of the three four energy manifestation of as everything in the spiritual world. The number of living entities are far greater than the number of living entities here in this material world. Uh, and they are our own. So, spiritual planet, Golokanamni, Nijadhamni, Talita, Tasha, Bibi, Mahesha, Haridhamsu, Teshu, Teshu, Pite, Prabhava, Nichaya, Vihita, Sajena, Govinda, Madi, Buddhism, Tamaham, Baja. This is Govinda. Govinda is one, and Eka Brahma Dityanasti, and Eka Bahushama, and he has become so many. It's like from the seed, one seed, a small seed. When it is grown up, rectified, you find big banyan tree, and so many big, big branches, trees, and so many fruits. Uh, each fruit contains again the seed, and each seed contains again millions of trees. This is trees. But the origin is one. Origin is one. Sarva karana karanam, Krishna. Brahmeti paramatmeti bhagavaniti sadhati bhagavan. He is the origin of everything. Aham sarvasya pravas. Matta sarmam pravartati. Janmardasya jadva. These are the Shastri Bhattan. So, here is also Shaun, here is also sky. That the beginning of this material world is from the sound vibration. I think the scientists also agree, the materialistic scientists, that from sound everything emerges. So, similarly, the same sound, you can enter into the spiritual world by taking shelter of sound. That sound vibration is Hare Krishna Mahamantra. If you chant Hare Krishna Mahamantra by chanting the transcendental, eternal sound, you can approach. Just like by telephone, there is also sound, cling, 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 immediately you in touch with your friend thousands and thousands of miles away. The sound is so uh, important thing. My spiritual sound, you can become immediately in touch with the spiritual world and gradually you become in touch with the Supreme Law. Kirtana Deva Krishna. Krishna has got so many expansions. Rama Dimutsisukala Niyamina Tishthar. Ram Nishinga Varaha, Kurma, Bhavan, so many. Hundreds of thousands. But Krishna is the Rama Dimutsisukala Niyamina Tishthar Nana Vatara Matarat Bhavani Sikiltu. Hindu. Krishna Sayam Samavava, Paravapavani. The original person, the Supreme Lord, Krishna Subhagavan Sayam, he also comes. Ramadi Murtishu, Ramnishunga Varaha, that is Krishna's expanse and incarnation, they also come, and Krishna also comes. Krishna Sayam Samavava, Paravapavani. He is the Supreme Person, Uman. Uman means the Purusha, the enjoyer, the proprietor. That is Krishna. So, immediately you can be in touch with Krishna by vibrating the sound, Hare Krishna. It is so potent. Nama Chintavani Krishna, Chaitanya Rasavigraha. The name of Krishna is Chintanam, transcendent. It is not this material sound 
material le chaitan living fall chetan it is not dead sound uh, if you want to water if you chant only water 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 you will not get what because it is material sound the water substance is different from the word what therefore simply by chanting water water you cannot quench your thirst you must have this substance what that is material sound anything you take simply by chanting the name you will not get the thing that is material but in the spiritual world the name and the person or the substance is the same there is no difference krishna or krishna's name is the same there is no difference therefore those who are chanting krishna 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 they are becoming more and more enlightened enthusiastic to chant anandamadi vardhanam chaitanya mahapurusha says by chanting hari krishna the first installment of benefit is chetadatmana marjanam you become cleans of your heart means of the contamination of your heart there are many verses ah uh, sinnadan shapata krishna punna savana kirt if you don't get anything because there is nama parat offenses in chanting there are ten kinds of offenses so if you can have heard the offenses the name is pure krishna but even though it is chanted offensively by chanti chanti you become cleans chito that panamarjanam it may take little time but be sure that your consciousness will be clean clear transparent and that is the no consciousness at the present moment we have got consciousness but that is contaminated i am american conscious i am indian conscious somebody is dark conscious that conscious so many conscious but by chanting this parikrishna mantra this contamination of the consciousness will be free crystallized it is then you come to krishna conscious and as soon as you come to krishna consciousness then you are in direct touch we are direct in touch with krishna but it is covered by some cloud of ignorance otherwise nothing can exist without krishna's touch that is not possible maya tadam idam sarvam jagat abhaktam urtira one krishna is expanded all over the creation maya tadam idam sarvam isha vasam nidam sarvam krishna is everywhere but due to the contamination of material modes of nature we are thinking apart from krishna separate from krishna or you do not know krishna although you are in touch so that is to be clean the by media impediment has to be clean that is called chito dhatvana madhyana by chanting this transcendental vibration your heart will be clean punna samana kirtan the more in chant you are here samana kirtan then it becomes pious activities pious activities means becoming free from the impious sinful reaction that is the result by chanting hari krishna vibration and the sound you gradually become clean chito dhatpana madhyanam chito dhatpana dhatpana means mirror just that like in the mirror there are dust covering you cannot see your face clearly but if it is very nicely clean then you can see how beautiful is your face so similarly as soon as you begin chanting hari krishna mahamantra you 
gradually become self-realized. Aham Brahmasmi. Simply by chanting. Aham Brahmasmi can understand. Then gradually, what is the duty? Simply to understand Aham Brahma, Soham. I am spirit soul. Soham means I am the same spirit soul as Krishna, he, as God is. Not that I become Krishna. That is mistake. That means it is not claims. You can become qualitatively one with Krishna. But if you think that you have become Krishna, Mahavad philosophy, that means your art is not yet means. Jannir Vindak Vimukta Mani Tai Asabhavad Abhishuddha Buddhaya Abhishuddha Buddha. Those are thinking that it is called Angraha Vasana, Ikatena, to become one. One in quality, not in quantity. We cannot become God. That is not possible. But we can attain God's quality. Now we are, we have our God's quality because we are part and parcel of God. But it is covered by the material motion. Triguna. Mannati trigunayatmakam. Jaya vimahita jiva mannati trigunayatmakam. Being covered by this illusory energy, the jiva, the living being, although it is transcendental, as good as Krishna, but mannati trigunayatmakam, is thinking that I am one of the products of this material world. This is karma. This is called illusion. This is called ignorance. So, Chita Dhatmana Marjana means you will be free from this ignorance that I am something of this material world. This is one day. So long uh, we are not realized, self realized, that we are no better than these cats and dogs. That they do not know that he is not the body. See, if we think that I am this body, then we are no better than the cats and dogs. So if you want to become happy, but first of all, we must get this knowledge that I am not this body. Now we are busy with the bodily demand of life. We are not busy for spiritual demand of life. That is the business of the human being. That I am not this material body. I am spirit soul. So my business is different from the business at the present moment we are engaged in. Everyone is engaged for satisfying the bodily necessities of life. Everyone. The cats and dogs, animals, they are also busy. How to fulfill the demands of the body. The demands of the body are four. Ahara nidra bhaya mancha. Ahara means eating. And nidra, nidra means sleeping. Ahara nidra bhaya. Bhaya means to become careful, to become anxious, and full of anxieties. Ahara nidra bhaya. And moitha and sexual intent. So these are the demands of the body. This they are called vishaya. Vishaya means so-called enjoyable. Vishaya. But the Vaishnava said that vishaya chariya shirase majiya muke bala hari hari. The transcendental sound hari, hari krishna should be chanted vishaya chariya without any attraction for this vishaya. Aharo nidra bhaya maithana. Then it will be perfect. Nidyahar viharata di vijito chattanto dino chajo. The Goswami. They come kind of at these things. Nidyahara vihara. That is required. That is spiritual life. If you are embarrassed with these four things, Aharo nidra bhaya maithana cha. Then we are not making progress in spiritual life. It should be reduced. Uh, just like Raghunath Das Goswami did. 
all the good science. They are no business. But that is very difficult if one has to mm. imitate the behavior of Rupa Goswami and all the Goswamis. It is very difficult. Therefore, Dikta Bhairag, we must eat Krishna Prasadam as much as it is needed for maintaining my body. Ahara Nidra Bhairag. In this way, spiritual progress of life. But it will be very easy if we join this transcendental vibration, Hare Krishna, Mantra, offenseless, Niraparadhe, then immediately become advanced, not only advanced, actually spiritually situated. So this sound is very important thing. The sound is the cause of our bondage in this material world. Just like in big, big city, we are attached to the sound vibrated by the cinema artist. And not only that, so many other things we are hearing through the radio message, attachment for the sound. And because it is material sound, we are becoming materially entangled. Entangled more and more. Some actress, some cinema artist singing. And people are so fond of hearing that singing that the artist is paid 15,000 rupees for one song. There are many here in Bombay. So just see how much attraction we have got for the material sound vibration. Similarly, the same attachment, if we turn to hear about Hare Krishna Mahamantra, then he become liberated. The same sound. One is material, one is spiritual. So we practice to be attached by the spiritual sound vibration. Then your life will be successful. So, this Krishna consciousness moment is meant for this purpose that you have already attachment for sound. Now, just transfer this attachment for spiritual sound when your life will be successful. This is Hare Krishna moment. Teaching people how to transfer the attachment from material sound to the spirituals. Narkam Das Thakur therefore sings, Golopera Premo Dhano Hari Nama Sankhi Gitsana Roti Na Jan Mila Mahatata this sound coming from the spiritual world, Golopera Premodham, by chanting, by hearing this sound, we shall develop our original dormant love for God. That is one thing. Prema Pumartha Maha. In the material world, we are accepting Dharmartha Kama Moksha as very important. Purusharth. Normal to become religious. And by becoming religious, we develop our economic development. Dhanang Dehi, Rupang Dehi, Jasu Dehi, Dehi Dehi, Kaam. Why Dehi Dehi? Not Kaam. To fulfill our desires, lusty desires. Dharma Artha Kama. And when you are disgusted or unable to fulfill desires, then you want moksha, to become one with God. This is the four kinds of Material business. But spiritual business is prema pumartha maha. To achieve love of God, that is the highest protection. Prema pumartha maha. So, to achieve this goal of life, prema pumartha maha, who in this age, especially, because we cannot do any other thing, it is very, very difficult. The time is full of obstacles. 
that far. Hello, this is the method. Hare Nama, Hare Nama, Hare Nama, you appear. John Hare Krishna, then. Give along. Only. Hello, Nasi, 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 Vada, Tirannatha. In the Kali Yuga, because main business is how to get relief from this material bondage. Bhutta, Bhutta, Paliyate. People do not understand even that. What is really our distress? Krishna says, the Supreme Personality of God says personally, we are your misery. Why? Janma Mitra Janabhadi. Irikitation of what's on death. This is your real misery of life. What you are thinking of this misery or that misery? They are all temporary. They are all under the laws of material nature. You cannot get out of it. Prakriti kramanani gunai karmani sarams. Prakriti will force you to do something because you have contaminated the material modes of nature. Therefore, you have to act under the direction of this prakriti material nature. And so long you are under this material nature, you have to accept this birth, death, old age, and disease. This is your real misery. We are thinking temporary. Miserable condition. Shastra says that you don't require to adjust temporary material misery or happiness because they will come and go. You are destined to certain type of miserable condition of life, certain type of so-called happy life that will automatically come and go. That's a seasonal thing. Agama paina anitya. We are very much happy when you are in a very good condition of life. But that will also not stay. That will also go out. Then miserable condition. Chakravat parivartanti sukhani dukhani. Sometimes happy, sometimes miserable. So, if you are actually interested to get out of miserable condition, then try to get out of these four miserable conditions of life. Janma mittu jarabhadi. That is interesting. Don't be bothered with the temporary miserable or happy. They will come and go. Tanatitik khasala. If you cannot bear, then try to tolerate. That is the qualification of Brahman. Satta sama dava titika. Tolerance. We should not be disturbed. Now I am in miserable condition. Tolerate the miserable condition will come in this material world. Don't be very much happy when you are in happy condition of life. Neither you become mad in miserable condition of life. Chant Hare Krishna and make your life such a, that is required. This is the propaganda of this Hare Krishna movement or Krishna consciousness. Thank you very much. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna.